Hello, 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 and welcome everybody to Poncho Thon on Facebook Live number 44. Yes, how y'all doing out there? We are doing fine, hanging in here, navigating the new world that we are living in. I'm trying to stay creative at the studio. Got a couple of nice projects going on. So, you know, we're just tuning in to see who's out there. We have a full show today. You know, on every show, uh, we show every Wednesday at 7 o'clock. Uh, our schedule will probably fluctuate a little bit in the coming months as we get into our normal summer schedule. A spring summer schedule, I should be saying. Uh, but meanwhile, we'll be broadcasting here every Wednesday. And um, hopefully you'll see some things you like. You know, our whole intention here is to continue introducing you to art, making it, uh, um, we're trying to make it back, uh, make it back a priority. Because for the longest time, we have been distracted by so many things. That is very difficult to um, sometimes keep us on the right track as far as what we should be supporting and what we should not be supporting. So, yeah, we are really trying to keep things moving. And, uh, you know, uh, so if you guys got any questions out there, feel free to participate. We got, hey, Scott Juice is out there. That's my girl from Baltimore. Down in ATL. Wanda Leggins. Hey, what's up, Luanda? How you doing? Just trying to keep it all moving. Wanda Leg is down and uh, what's that? What's that state? Did they have to have tax? There you go. Delaware is in the house. That's right. What's happening? How you doing there? So yeah, that's what's up with us, man. We're just trying to keep the ball rolling, keep you guys introduced to what's going on. Look, we got some really nice projects coming up. I'm going to tell you about some of those things in um, as the show goes on. But first of all, I want to show you. Let's just get the maybe we'll just get the the, the house rules out of the way. All right, so here we go, y'all. House rules are, you place the item number and the word sold in the comments section to purchase anything from this show, okay? Why sold, Poncho? Because I have people that have collected this work. I have people who would like the work, and sometimes they'll put the number of the piece they'd like, but they, you know, they're participating in our comment stream. So we're encouraging commenting but we also want to make sure we don't ship you the wrong stuff. So, <laughs> so make sure you put the item number and the word sold. That way we know that's a two-part commitment that you are interested in that piece, okay? The most important uh, piece of house uh, rules we got around here is to please inbox us your email address and shipping address. You can either do that at The Art of Poncho. You can do that at uh, Larry Poncho Brown on my personal page or my business page. You can also post it to, well, for right now, just put it at the Art of Poncho. How about that to make it simple? There you go. So there you go. That's how we do it around here. Just put it in the comment stream, the word sold. We will check that. You will receive a PayPal invoice at the end of the show. It might not be tonight. It might be tomorrow sometime maybe before the weekend is over uh, to commit to the pieces that you selected. This show and items on this show are good for one week. Okay. Uh, we're also broadcasting on the Art of Poncho, my personal, my, my business page, Larry Poncho Brown, my personal page, and YouTube on my YouTube channel. Look up 
um, Larry Poncho Brown. Please subscribe, ring that bell, boom, and that way you can keep up with what we're doing here. Third house rule is that it is a $10 flat rate shipping per package. $10 flat rate per package. That's right, y'all. Now, I got to tell you, pretty soon that might change. Uh, UPS's rates have started to go up, and uh, most people are trying to adjust their rates for all of the volume of stuff that's been going through the mail. So, there you go. Hey, what's up? Uh, you know, Debbie Allen out of Chi-Town. What's happening, Miss Jones? How are you? Thank you for checking in. Yeah, so those are the house rules. That's pretty much what's up around here. We're going to get ready to get started shortly. And um, what can I say? Um, I, I, you know what, y'all? I'm, I'm listening to all of the herd immunity out there. I hope y'all guys are doing good. I heard about the, some of y'all got that Johnson & Johnson. You know, so I know some of y'all are a little nervous right now, but that's okay. We, I think we're going to be all right. What's going on, Mr. Rasheen Pugh? I'm going to give it to you, brother. It's yours. How you doing, Carolyn Gray? What's up, Karen Y? I call her the notorious KYB. That's Karen Y. Busting my partner in crime. What's happening, Ms. White? Thank you all for tuning in. We are going to get ready to get started, but I want to tell you about a couple things that's coming up so you can look out for them. The first thing is... My partner, Mr. Lavalet, is doing another BAM show. That's the Black Art Marketplace. That's going to be happening again this weekend. So if you don't, if you get a chance, tune into the show, y'all. I mean, you're talking about, you know, you, if you like this show and the format of the show, I have uh, been working with many artists who have now made online their store. So it's a lot of programming. On this show right here, you might see 15 to 20 artists and selling their wares. So if you get a chance this weekend, check us out. I will be on on friday night at 9 p.m eastern standard time if you want to check me out again but pet you know what give me a favor y'all pass it out to your friends now y'all can't keep all the goodies for yourself okay uh we're trying to encourage folks to buy now on this show when you buy one of a piece and for every piece you buy you get something free that's the basic house rule around here because we are trying to uh, motivate you all to share art, gift art, and we are about to get this party started. All right, y'all, here we go. Item number one for today is, what can I say? We got the Poncho Hologram Sticker. The Poncho Hologram Sticker. It measures three inches, y'all. This is a nice piece of refrax that I like can go on any surface. These are very good stickers. You know, we partnered with Sticker Mule. Sticker Mule does all of our um stickers they're very high quality but you know on this show we start low we go up high the first item of the day item number one if you're interested in it it is the poncho hologram sticker it only measures it measures three inches it's only three dollars on poncho thon that's right y'all if you want that piece just put item number one and sold and the poncho hologram sticker will be coming your way item number two we are rolling. Item number two is the affirmation cards. These were just released earlier this year. You get about 12 cards with affirmations written by Jennifer Ayanna Harrison, my partner in crime on this project. She's got some words of wisdom coupled with my um, images. You can give these in a card. You can give these uh, in somebody's hand. You know, it's just, um, you know, hold yourself on task. We're all trying to become better spiritual people and stay uh encouraged and so these this affirmation card set is what this is designed for this is um they measure two by three and a half inches comes in a clear case if you want that piece of put item number two and sold and the affirmation cards will be yours for just eight dollars y'all eight dollars the affirmation cards item number three Item number three is something we put out early this year. It had laid off one complete year. We decided to bring it back again. This is the Art of Poncho desk calendar. Yes, you know my other calendar, my wall calendar for 2021 has already sold out for those of you that did not get it. But I will tell you that this calendar runs from the time you purchase it into the following year. So we decided to make this a perpetual calendar that can be run all year round. If you like this calendar, it comes in a clear case. It's got all 12 months and it's going to be more than that because you're going to get upwards through April of 2022. If you like that piece right there, it makes a really, really nice gift. This is the Art of Poncho desk calendar. It measures four by six. If you want that, just put item number three and sold in the Poncho desk calendar. 
will be coming your way for just ten dollars, y'all. Just ten dollars. Calling all deltas, calling all deltas. I know KYB is out there. We got one delta watching. This is the DST no card set. We uh, released these at the 100th anniversary of the Delta Sigma Theta when it came to Washington, D.C., and we are still marketing these. So this is our um, our assorted box card set, 12 cards with 12 envelopes, comes with a gold box and a gold little rip. Come on. How many sores can you make happy? And you know what? In this show, we are trying to make people send some love notes, send some note cards, let some people know you're thinking about them. This social distancing is driving everybody crazy. So it would be nice for people to get something from you in your own words. Brighten up somebody's day. Item number four. If you want the DST note card set, comes with 12 cards, 12 envelopes. This box sells for $15. Item number 14. I mean, item number four and sold. And uh, the Delta Sigma Theta note card set will be coming your way. Item number five. It's a new item we released earlier this year. You know what? I do a lot of sketching. I wake up in the middle of the night. Sometimes I have dreams. I write my dreams down. So I said, why not come up with these idea books? One is line. One is online. These are my create something. No, uh, uh, these I call these to create something idea book set. Okay. Um, you get both books. One is line. One online for your sketches or your words. This whole set normally sells for twenty dollars. You can get both books in the create something idea book set. For just $15, they measure six by nine, 50 pages. That's a lot of ideas, y'all. You got to get it out your head to bring it to fruition. A lot of people to run around thinking that they are creating something because they come up with ideas. You know who you are out there. Stop smiling. You know, you're the idea person. Light bulb, bing. But if you don't get it out your head, it ain't going to happen. Item number five is to create something idea book set. You get that for $15. If you want that, just put item number five in soul. That will be coming your way. Getting to some artwork here. Here is a piece that I did on my iPad, y'all. You know, sometimes when I'm taking on long flights, I take up my iPad. This was done for all of you other artists that's watching and you want to see how to, uh, to work. Paper 53 is the, uh, the, the software that I use, the app I use to do this piece. The Gathering is a 13 by 19 print. If you like this piece, just put item number six and sold and the gather will be coming your way for just $15, y'all. The gathering, item number seven. Item number seven is a popular uh, little piece here. You know, I do a lot of pieces devoted to family. This piece is called the reason for being, the reason for being. The size is 17 by 22 inches. Yeah, you see it's got a lot of really nice adinkra symbols in there, and I want to let you figure out what those adinkra symbols mean. What I will tell you is the main one on the man's shirt means omnipotence of God. Fear no one except God. The rest of them are different versions of Sankofa and other symbols that deal with faith. If you like this piece, item number seven normally sells for $40. On Ponchothon number 44, you can get this piece for just $20, y'all. Item number seven. If you want item number seven, just put item number seven and sold, and this piece will be coming your way. So what's happening with y'all? How y'all feeling out there? We are trying to keep it moving. You know we got a brand new website, right, y'all? So if you don't get a chance, if you get a chance, check out the new website. We are um, really trying to make it as modern as we can make it. So check us out at LarryPonchoBrown.net. LarryPonchoBrown.net. That's our latest website. It's got a virtual tour and it's got lots of little goodies. If you want to check it out, we will be updating this thing regularly. And soon we will be also featuring original works for the very first time on this website. So check us out and see what's going on. And that, hey, we're trying to keep you up to date on what's happening, y'all. So you got to stay tuned in. <laughs> Item number eight, y'all, is a piece we call A Common Vision. A Common Vision. This piece is a limited edition piece. It's one of my smaller limited edition pieces. It actually measures 14 by 20 inches. This is a 1,000 edition, but we are treating this like one of our open edition prints today. You know, every now and then on the show, we just pull something out of the warehouse that people have not seen at great prices. This is a limited edition piece. We're selling it in our open edition section, y'all. Item number eight is called A Common Vision. You know, in Yoruba, 
twins are looked at as good luck. This piece was based on that that concept. I have uh, godsons that are twins. And I actually lost a set of twins in 1986. That's another whole story. But I have a fascination with twins. Item number eight. If you like that piece, A Common Vision, it normally sells for $75, y'all. $75. Today on Punchathon number 44, you can get that piece for just $20. If you want that piece, just put item number eight and sold. And this piece will be coming your way. Item number nine. You know, every now and then I pull out some of my um, commemorative posters. This is a collectible poster. It was done for the Western Maryland Blues Fest. I was a featured artist for uh, 2016. This was the piece that they used on that poster. I have probably 20 of these posters in my studio. They normally sell for $40. If you want a nice commemorative for your wall and you like blues music, and you know, I like a little blues, item number nine, y'all. If you want that piece, this is the Western Maryland Blues Fest commemorative poster. Normally sells for $40. Measures 18 by 28 inches. It can be yours for just $20, y'all. That's right, y'all, just $20. This piece right here will look nice. If, you know, you got two ways you can do commemoratives. Commemoratives can be framed uh, for the essence of the historical thing that happened. Or you can take it into the border and frame it, frame the words out if that's what you decide to do. Item number nine, y'all. If you like that piece, just put item number nine and sold. And this Western Blues, Western Merlin Blues Festival poster will be yours for just $20, y'all. Hey, y'all, guess what? We introduced the Poncho Swag Box um, in early March. We have sold over 50 of them. We are getting ready to release uh, Poncho Swag Box number two. This is Poncho Swag Box number one. This comes with 11 different items in it, y'all. 11 items for one price. These are things you can use, you can give as gifts. Um, we're going to keep on creating these. The next one is we're working on right now. We'll probably release that on the next show. This is item number 10, y'all. Comes with note cards, comes with that calendar we showed earlier. It's got stickers, it's got magnets, it's got buttons, it's got uh, postcards. It's got a little bit of everything in it. Nice little gift valued at around $45, y'all. But today on Punch of Dawn number 44, this is the last time you can get this swag box, y'all. Item number 10. Just put item number 10 and sold. And the Punch of Swag Box number one will be coming your way. And be looking out for swag box number two. Item number 10 and sold. And this will be coming your way. Item number 11, y'all, it is that time of the year, and we are bringing back out the retro tees. What's a retro tee, Poncho? At 19, um, man, early 1990, I released some retro tees of a piece called Black is Black and Embrace. Do you know people are still wearing those shirts? Because they were done with silk screening, multicolor silk screening. These are not inexpensive shirts to make but they last forever, okay? It's a lot of junk on the, on, the, on the market right now because you got this dye sublimation stuff you can do, these buy one uh, at a time or per order stuff. This is actually a silk screen shirt of Surrender and we did it purple on purple, y'all. Item number 11 is the Surrender T. Now, you know, for those of you that are out there, please don't be upset with me, y'all. You know, my small people, my small and my sme my medium folk, my medium folk don't like me with the retro T line because they start at large XL, double XL, and triple XL. So don't be mad at me, y'all. I have other stuff for you later on in the season. But for right now, the Retro T, item number 11, this is the Surrender Retro T in purple. It also comes in black. But if you like this piece, it normally sells for $50. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get item number 11 for just $40, y'all. Now look, uh, just like I just uh, gave a disclaimer to my mediums out there, my large people, my double XL, my triple XL, you know, normally uh, we would charge more for those shirts, but on Ponchothon, all of the shirts are one flat rate. So if you want to grab yours now, grab it. Put item number 11, so and your size on this particular piece, and we will get those your way. And you'll be ready for when we in spring, y'all. Don't be fooled. It's time. Item number 11. And sold, and that piece will be coming your way. This is another piece of the retro line. This came out last year, y'all. This was the Forgotten Journey, our most popular limited edition piece. Um, this is the uh, colorized edition. It comes in gray, steel gray. You know, that's a really nice looking shirt, y'all. Same thing here. 
It's medium, folk. Don't be mad at me. This is item number 12, the Forgotten Journey Retro Tea. Normally sells for $50. You can get it for $40 today. Make sure you put item number 12 and the word uh, sold and your size. And the Retro Tea will be yours for just $40. Normally $50, y'all. We do have long sleeve versions of this, but you can get those online at uh, LarryPonchoBrown.net, y'all, because we got a new site just for y'all. <laughs> Item number 12 and sold, and the Forgotten Journey t-shirt will be yours for just $40. Item number 13. We are moving into the G Clay section, y'all. You know what? We try to give you some high collectibles. You know, Poncho, what is a G Clay? A G Clay is a French term meaning spray of ink. In the G Clay process, a stream of ink is it's a fine stream of ink. More than four million droplets per second is on this machine. Um, it's sprayed into archival paper or canvas. These prints have a higher resolution offset lithograph prints, which is the majority of the color pieces you see on the market, and the color range is uh, greater than a serograph. So that is what a G-clay is. You see that term. People call them G-clays, all kinds of names, but that's what a G-clay are. We are in the, the G-clay section, y'all. Are you ready? Oh, let me send a reminder to all of you that's new to the show. We see our numbers going up from viewership. This is the house rules for those of you that are just tuning in. That's right, y'all. Those are the house rules. Item number 13 is a piece we call the inquisitive one. Yeah, 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 I know. Inquisitive is a word that sounds much better than nosy. If I called it the nosy one, we probably wouldn't sell many of them. But if I say the inquisitive one, yeah, some of the nosy people would be interested in it. I don't know if you have a circular piece on your wall at home, but you haven't really seen something dynamic until you have framed a circular piece on your wall. This piece right here is a conversation piece. Item number 13 the Inquisitive One, one of my collage series. This piece normally sells for $300 and measures 24 by 24 inches. The edition size is only 62. All of my G-Clay editions are very, very small. This is item number 13, the Inquisitive One, the G-Clay. On Poncho Thon number 44, you can get this G-Clay for $100. That is one third of the retail price. Now, y'all might say, Poncho, why are you doing that? Because I can. This is the one place where I can control what my customers get. You can't get these prices anywhere online. You can't walk into a gallery and get these prices. You can't go to my website and get these prices. Poncho Thon is put in place for you guys to have an incentive to get some pieces to start your collection or to enhance your collection. Item number 13 is the inquisitive one. If you want that piece, just put item number 13 and sold, and you can have that $300 piece for $100. Next up, item number 14. It's part of a set, if you like that piece. This piece is entitled Looking for Love, the G. Clay. Now, t trust and believe. You got those two pieces next to each other. Mm, mm, mm. Silver frame, black frame, circular mat. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Item number 14. If you like this piece, Looking for Love, the G. Clay, it normally sells for $300. It is a 62 edition. It measures 24 by 24 inches. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get this piece for just, that's right, y'all, $100. If you'd like to add this piece to your collection, just put item number 14 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. That's right, y'all. We are moving and grooving. Look, we got some more people shouting out out here. What's happening, CM? You know, I don't know what everybody's names is. What's up, Miss Miss Gibson? I haven't seen you in ages. How y'all doing? Uh, what's happening, Miss Jackie? Philly y'all Hoskins. She's also a part of my artist family. To what's up, to Rary Marshall? What's going on? How are you? Thank you for participating. What's up, Madeline Garford? You know I love you, baby. I'm glad to hear you're doing okay. Brian Branch, my main man, this guy right here is a helping artist also you know one of the leggings love surrender but one of the leggings probably got all my work y'all she is a super fan i have a super fan category i want the leggings would be on that list Hush. what's up miss marcella oliver thank you for checking in that's right y'all we're going to keep it moving item number 15 is a g clay we call 
This is called a place of power. A place of power. How many of y'all feel like you need that to be on your wall to, you know, be an example of where you are in your life? This is one of those pieces that I had fun doing, a little small piece, but we decided to make it as a G Clay. Item number 15, meditative piece, introspective piece. Sells for $300 normally, measures 22 by 24. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get this piece for $100. That's right, y'all. If you want that piece, item number 15 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Item number 16, y'all. You know, this is a special that I don't do too often. You know, I, I've been doing these exhibition catalogs for my solo exhibitions for quite a few years now. Stronger Than Pride was a big solo exhibition I did in Springfield, Massachusetts. Soundscapes happens to be a show that I did at Baltimore City Hall a couple of years ago. And the Collages catalog was actually held at the Motor House. And we were doing an extension of the Collages show at the Frederick Douglass Myers Museum here in Baltimore, um, probably in the month of June. But you get all three of these catalogs, 28 pages with tons of art, nice coffee table books. All of them come signed. Number 16 is the exhibition catalog collection. If you want that, just put item number 16 in sold. That normally will cost you about $75. Today, you can get all three for $60, and they will all come signed. And you will have a great overview of some of the new works that I've been doing. Item number 16 and sold. If you want that piece, just put number 16 in sold, and the exhibition catalogs will be coming your way. All right, y'all, it is spring. Are you guys ready for spring? Are you guys digging up your yard? Are you guys now trying to make sure you in step for spring? You know, um, I'm going to tell you, I'm a brown thumb. I can't grow nothing. But um, that's not to say that I don't admire um, people's yards because people have all kinds of stuff in their yards. But I'm going to get ready to show you something that we've been selling in the last couple of years that will enhance your yard right after this. <music> Item number 17, y'all, is what we call the Sister's Journey Garden Art. It's the Garden Art Large. We call it the Sister's Journey Garden Art Large because this comes in two sizes. The one we're showing on today's show is a 24-inch tall piece of lawn sculpture. You can go in your garden. You can go in your flower pots. You can go in your flower beds. Your neighbors will definitely be jealous. It is made for outdoors. This is item number 17. If you want to bring your garden in the swing early, item number 17, just put the uh, 17 and so in the Sister's Journey Garden Art Large will be coming your way. It normally sells for $80. It's 24 inches tall. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get that piece for just $70, y'all. $70 if you want a piece of sculpture for your yard. And why not? Art should be everywhere. It shouldn't be just on your wall. It should be in every part of your life. You should wear your art. You should display your art. You should buy things that have art on them. That's what we're all about. That's why, you know, we're the most copied people on the planet because of our style. So why not take it down to everything? We're doing housewares now. You're going. I've seen some exciting stuff this last couple of years. And if you check out the BAM show this weekend, which I'll give you some information to in a few, you're going to see some stuff that you can't see nowhere else. And Personally, y'all be commenting on my shirts and my glasses and my hats and stuff around here. Check out BAM. You'll have some of the same stuff. Item number 17, y'all, is the Sister's Journey Garden Art Large. Item number 17. If you want that, just put 17 in. So that piece will be coming your way. We also last year started item number 18. We actually did some steel sculptures for your yard, too. This piece right here is the Name Dua Garden Goddess. Say that three times. She measures 24 inches from the base of the stake to the top of her head. This piece right here is in raw steel. Pancho, tell me about the raw steel. The raw steel is cut. And what we expect to happen is that it will age on its own. It will uh, oxidize on its own and do its own thing. So she's starting out with uh, uh, the regular steel color, but she'll turn rich colors of brown over time. 
and she will still stand out in your yard. You want something a little different? Try it. This is the Niame Boot Doer Garden Goddess. Normally she would sell for $95. That's right. You get a piece of lawn sculpture out of steel for $95. But on this show, item number, I mean, um, show poncho thon number 44. You can get item number 18 for just $75. Normally it's $95. It's springtime, y'all. Imagine this beautiful piece in your yard. Item number 18 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Item number 19, y'all. We are getting to the larger G. Clay Prince, y'all. This is the part of the show where if you're looking to expand your collection, we got some really, really nice stuff here. And before we get started, I'm going to remind you that we do have a brand new website. Check it out. That's right, y'all. We're about to get it started. This is the sh part of the show for you young collectors. This is the part of the show for those of you who have been collecting for a while. These are our higher collectible pieces. This is the G. Clay section of the show. Item number 19, y'all, is a piece that I did for my 50th birthday. In my 50th birthday, I released three pieces in my favorite color, purple. This piece is called The Guardian, the purple edition. The Guardian normally sells for $300. It measures 22 by 26. It is a 62 edition, y'all. Today on Punch-Out-Thon number 44, you can get The Guardian Purple Edition for just $150. Normally $300. That is half price. Special for Punch-Out-Thon number 44. If you like this piece, just put item number 19 and sold in The Guardian Purple Edition will be added to your collection. Hey, y'all, if you got three pieces, you got a collection, in case you didn't know it. Item number 20 is a piece we call Nothing But The Blues. You know, I got a little blues thing happening here on the show today. Um, this piece is called Nothing But The Blues. It was released as a canvas G. Clay. We also have this in paper, the show today on item number 20. You can get this piece. It normally sells for $400. Most of the pieces in this G. Clay section retail for four hundred dollars okay today on poncho thon you can get that piece for two hundred dollars item number 20 if you like that piece and you want a little flavor of music in your house this is a nice size piece too it measures 24 by 32 inches if you want that piece just put item number 20 and soul and nothing but the blues will be coming your way item number 21 is part of a series it's called smooth jazz number four it is a G clay. It measures 24 by 30 inches. The price, retail price of this is $400. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get Smooth Jazz number four for just $200. That's right, y'all, $200. Hey, you want a nice musical piece? Something kind of abstract? Look, y'all don't, look, look, look I, gotta, I gotta go full screen on this because I, I gotta talk to my people out here. Those of you that are matching your art to furniture, curtains, sofas, that's not how we do it, y'all. Um, you want to frame the piece, the essence of the piece, what's going to accent the piece, and you also want to be surrounded by pieces that move you. So once you start matching colors, you actually restrict yourself. If you look behind me, you see all the different colors of frames and art in this room. There's a balance because colors play off of everything that's in your room. So rather than restricting yourself by matching that, that aqua blue sofa you bought back in the 70s, <laughs> yeah, you want to frame your work for the essence of it, and it will last you a much longer time. Remember, your art is going to last much longer than your furniture. Item number 21 is smooth jazz number four if you want this piece just put at number 21 and so this piece normally sells 200 dollars. it's a 62 edition it will be yours today on poncho thon number 44 for just 200 dollars. that's right y'all moving along item number 22 is part of a set you want two pieces that's rocking these look really good with brown frames gold frames black frames you name it it's going to pull out whatever's happening in your area got a nice piano in your room got another instrument in your room these are two pieces that will go on two sides of a bigger item, too. Item number 22. This piece is a title for Smooth Jazz number 5 of G. Clay. If you like that piece, just put item number 25 and sold. 
and that peace will be coming your way. That's right, y'all. We try to give you a little something different on the show. I got some stuff I'm about to show you, y'all. Yeah, I hope y'all can handle it. I hope y'all can handle it. It's going back in a day on me, item number 23. I do some introspective pieces, man, every now and then. My collage series, I consider to be some of my more serious works. This piece right here is entitled... Ooh, just look at her for a minute. This is entitled The Power Within. The Power Within. Uh, it has excerpts of Phenomenal Woman in this collage. If you uh, All of the words in there are pertinent to the piece. This is item number 23. The Power Within. G. Clay normally sells for $400. It's a 62 edition. Measures 24 by 30 inches. Today on Punch of Thunder number 44. You can get this piece for just $200. We are in the $200 section. These pieces are normally $400. If you like this piece, please just put item number 23 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Hey, y'all, we got a couple folks out there shouting out. Hey, right on, right on. What's going on, Joseph Beasley? That's right. Sky Juice is laughing at my jokes. You don't know which one, but, uh, you know, my corny jokes do come through every now and then. I... What's happening, Ms. Richardson? Thank you for checking in. Nice to see you again. Item number 23, y'all. If you like this piece, item number 23 and sold, and it will be coming your way. Item number 24 is part of my musical instrument series. Again, this is um, a piece called Textured Sounds Number 2. Textured Sounds Number 2. This piece generally sells for $400. It's a 62 edition, same size, 24 by 30. That is the sweet spot size. It's not too big, not too small. I consider this to be a medium to large G clay. By the time you put three inches of mat and an additional two to three, four inches of frame, you can have a very sizable piece with some of these pieces too. So I don't know 24. It's texture sounds number two. If you want that piece, just put item number 24 and sold. And that piece will be coming your way. Item number 25, y'all. You know, I love doing a few news every now and then. This is all abstract news. I have fun doing these. This piece is titled, Been So Long. Been So Long. Item number 25. This piece right here measures, again, 24 by 30. And it is a limited edition of 62. If you want something that's a reflection of you, this is it. Y'all know what I'm dealing with here. You can see the movement in this piece. I don't know in 25. See, I paint what I see. I paint things that look like the people I know. Ain't no size zero women in none of my artwork. I'm sorry. I'm not against you for being a zero. It's just not my reality. Item number 25. If you want this piece, just put item number 25 and soul and been so long. This look like my friend Sky Juice. Yes, it does. I don't know. You know, that's what happens with art. I got so many wonderful friends out there that sometimes they show up in my art. That's right. Item number 25. That's right. If you like this piece, item number 25 and sold, you can put this piece in a wonderful space in your house and strike up a conversation. Now, item number 25 and sold, this piece will be added to your collection. Item number 26. I can't just show the women and don't show the men. This piece is entitled Better Days Ahead. You know, I like showing nude men, and um, I like to show the vulnerability and strength of men. That's not something we get credit for often. Item number 26 is titled Better Days Ahead. It's normally sold for $400. It is also a 62 edition. All of the pieces that you have been witnessing are 62 editions. Poncho, why 62? Because yours truly was born in 1962. I could have done 50 prints. I could have done 40 prints. I just picked 62 because I figured it'd be a cool number since it's uh, a reflection of me. Item number 26. If you want that piece, just put item number 26 in. So, and Better Days Ahead will be yours for just $200 on Poncho Thun number 44. Item number 26 and so, and this piece will be coming your way. Item number 27, you know, every now and then I show my news. I got a lot of new pieces. They, I, I couldn't have done a, a new piece in 1980. I couldn't have done a piece in 1985 that was nude. I went all the way to 1990 before I released my first nude, which was in probably 1997. Because 1990, people weren't ready. 1995, people weren't ready. But by then, people started requesting nudes. And so I do a whole series of nudes. As a matter of fact, I am planning to do a whole catalog of my nude pieces in the next couple of months. So 
this piece right here, item number 27, is called Lustful Contours. Lustful Contour 62 edition. It measures 24 by 30 inches. Normally sells for $400 today on Poncho Thon number 44. You can get this piece for just $200. That's right, y'all. That is the number. $200. These pieces will appreciate quick. These are what I consider to be collectibles. Um, these are in the hands of lots of my collectors. Item number 27 and sold Lustful Contours. And this piece will be coming your way. Item number 28, y'all, is all about love. This piece is called Real Love, Real Love. I show this every now and then because my main man, Charles Bibbs, you know, he's one of my, my closest artist friends uh, next to the notorious KYB. I got a male and a female. This rocks on both sides, y'all. You got to shoot for that if you don't have that in your life. But my big brother steals pieces from me every now and then. And this is one he stole from me. Now, I know I stole is a strong word, but me and my boy, we have that opening where we can steal pieces from one another. So in other words, if Mandela, if he comes to, uh, not Mandela, if Charles Bibbs comes to my studio and he sees something he likes, he has the right to go on my wall, pull it off, and leave. Because he know I'm going to do the same thing when I get to the studio. This is one of those pieces, Real Love, owned by Mr. Charles Bibbs. This is item number 28. I'll give you a close-up of it. You need something that's a reflection of love on your wall. This is it right here. Look at that. How serene is that? That's right. And she's not a zero. If you like that piece, item number 28. And sold. And Real Love will be yours. Normally $400. It's a 62 edition. You will get it today on Poncho Thon number 20, I mean 44, for $200. That's right, y'all. If you want that piece, item number 28, Real Love will be coming your way. Item number 29, y'all, is part of my love series, y'all. This one right here is, uh, well, just look at it for a minute, because I know all of us can need at least a little hug right now with all this social distancing stuff going on. They're training us not to touch, y'all. I don't know how I feel about that yet. I'm missing some hugging, though. You know, I got folks still walking up on me with gloves and masks on. I don't even know how to deal with that. I'm just trying to be patient till this thing passed. But I'm a hugger. I'm a handshaker. So, yes, I feel a certain amount of detachment. So these pieces, item number 29. Want to get next to you is the title of this piece. Want to get next to you is part of my love series. Um, and I'm showing you three love pieces today. Item number 29, y'all. If you like that piece, item number 29 is entitled, Want to Get Next to You. If you like that piece, just put item number 29 and sold, and that piece will be yours for just $200 regularly, $400, y'all. Measurement on that is 24 by 30, part of my love series. Item number 30 is another piece for my love series. This piece right here, I was listening to my girl, Indy Irie, when I created this piece. The title of this piece is Yours Begins, Mine's Ends. Yours Begins, Mine's Ends. Looks how, how harmonious this piece is. Item number 30. You put that on your wall. Folks going to know what's up. You know what I'm saying? You can't just put that on your wall and don't know who you are. This piece right here is entitled Yours Begins, Mine's Ends. It normally sells for $400. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get this piece for just $200. Pay attention, y'all. Over the summer months, I will be releasing some pieces that people have not seen in a while and pieces that are hard to get. Item number 30. If you like that piece, just put item number 30 in soul. And yours begins. Mine ends. Will be coming your way. So you see what I'm talking about here? Look at that. Sky G says she's looking for some real love. That's right. Well, you know. That's what we all about here. Oh, nothing but hearts from CM. Who is CM? I wonder who CM is. You know? mystery if you like that piece y'all item number 30 and so that piece will be coming your way item number 31 well first of all i gotta come full screen for a minute because y'all not ready y'all not ready poncho used to do fantasy artwork i i originally started drawing from comic books thanks to my friend eric toons eric toons really were very instrumental in me going into art because we used to draw in his house now i told you i'm second generation my dad was an artist too right so i'm not taking away from my dad but sometimes you have a pivotal person that motivates you to draw my dad didn't motivate me to draw my buddy ricky did right i tried to copy what my dad was doing but at that paid stage in the eight in the 70s nobody had time to nurture no kids you know what i'm saying I, at least i didn't get that 
you know, my dad, I imitated him, but he didn't really, he was a frustrated artist, didn't have no outlet. So he wasn't trying to cheer me on. But I tell you what, before my dad passed, he was my biggest, biggest fan. These next pieces are pieces from my science fiction um, um, period of my life. Some of y'all ain't never seen this stuff, and they are floating around. There's probably 25 of these paintings floating around. We were able to recover two. Y'all know I had a big studio fire in 1995, right? Where I lost everything in the studio. And so to be able to recover these pieces was kind of special. All right, I guess y'all ready now. Item number 31 is from my sci-fi days, y'all. This piece is entitled Eclipse Ellipse. I was doing all kinds of robots and metallic surfaces. I really was into the science fiction thing. As a matter of fact, long before I started doing black art shows, I was doing science fiction conventions. Can you imagine Larry Poncho Brown at a science fiction convention? Some of y'all can, and some of y'all can't. But that's what I'm talking about right here, y'all. Item number 31 is a piece called Eclipse Lips to G. Clay. Normally sells for $400. The size is 24 by 30. If you want a little snapshot of something from my past and something a little different, this might be it. Item number 31 and sold in this piece. Eclipse Ellipse will be yours for just $200. But y'all ain't ready yet. Item number 32 is part of that same series. This one is entitled Staircase of Tomorrow. This is part of my sci-fi days. Sci-fi days was in 1980. Between 1980 and 1985, I must have created over 50 paintings of some of this stuff. Um, most of, not all of them were lost in the fire. Quite a few of them were sold to private collectors, and they have gems now because they didn't know what they had back then, and I probably sold them dirt cheap. Uh, but item number 32 is part of that series. If you like that piece and you want to match that other piece, Staircase of Tomorrow is the one. It measures 24 by 30. It normally sells for $400 today on Poncho Thon number 44. You can get Staircase of Tomorrow for just $200, y'all. That's right, y'all. I'm trying to show y'all some different stuff. I don't want y'all to think Poncho does the same thing all the time. That's not how we work around here. You know, I got a serious dance series that was comprised of probably maybe more than 25 pieces. As a matter of fact, we we're planning an exhibition catalog of my dance series. This is one of those pieces. This piece is entitled Ujima. Ujima. This was actually done for a festival in Cincinnati quite a few years ago, but we have that as a G. Clay. Item number 33. This piece is called Ujima. If you like dance, you like African dance, this piece should move you. This is... Can you hear the drums, y'all? Can you hear the drums? Can you hear the I can hear the drums. Can you hear the drums? Item number 33, y'all. If you like this piece, just put 33 in sold. It normally sells for $400. It is also a 62 edition. Today on Punch Your Thumb number 44, you can get this piece for just $200, y'all. That's right. Item number 33 in sold in Ujima will be coming your way. Item number 34, for those of you that need some music in your life, this piece right here is called Big D. That's right. I have a friend named Dwayne that plays a flugelhorn. This piece was painted of him quite a few years ago, but I've done a couple of renditions of it. This is probably my favorite one. Big D is the title of this piece. It measures 24 by 30 inches. If you want some music in your life, this is the piece. Item number 34 is entitled Big D. It is a G clay that measures 24 by 30 inches. Today on Poncho Thunder 44, you can get this piece for just $200, y'all. You need a little music in your life. This is the piece. Item number 34 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Item number 35, y'all, is part of my hat series. I did a couple of pieces with hats. Did one called Fine Young Man, but this one came before. This one is called Daddy's Home. Daddy's Home. This is a really nice, tranquil piece. Look at the colors in this, purples and greens and a lot of uh, neutral tones. This piece will be uh, in a nice corner. You know how Dad was subdued and just kind of was understated? This piece was done in the spirit of all the quiet men out there. Item number, quiet but strong men. Item number 35, y'all, is a piece called Daddy's Home. If you like that piece, it measures 24 by 30. It's a, also a 62 edition. Normally sells for $400 on Poncho Thon number 44. You can get this piece for just $200. If you want this piece, just put item number 35 in sold, and Daddy's Home will be coming your way. 
every now and then, you know, this piece right here, boom, is called Passionate Lady. Passionate Lady is actually on my clothing line. She's on a couple of my ponchos, which, you know, my poncho's been delayed, y'all. You know, all of the plants that do uh, the type of work to create those pieces that were closed because of COVID, last year was the first year we did not have ponchos available. We are hoping and praying that all of the looms will be back together in South Carolina pretty soon so that we can get these back on track. But meanwhile, this piece, Passionate Lady, is available as G. Clay, item number 36. If you want this piece, you hot blooded lady, you know who you are. You know who you are. I ain't even gotta tell you. You already scratching because you saw the piece when it came up. Item number 36, y'all. It's called Passionate Lady. It normally sells for four hundred dollars today on Punchathon number forty-four. You can get this piece for just two hundred dollars. We are having a massive G Clay sale today. If you guys don't know what's happening, you better tell a friend. And be looking out for future shows so you can snag up some of these specials. Item number 36 and Soul and Passionate Lady will be coming your way. Item number 37, y'all. You know, we get uh, we try to keep the show moving. We try to show you a 50-piece menu every show. Um, we try not to repeat too many items per show. But every now and then we do themed shows. But right now we've been doing some G. Clay special shows the last two shows. Might do something a little different. We've even done some shows that were all artist proofs. I'll tell you what that is a little later. Item number 37. It's a piece we call Spiritual Realm. Spiritual Realm, the G. Clay. It measures 24 by 30 inches. It's a nice little piece of a family reflecting. That could be a hymn. That could be a Bible. It depends on where you're coming from. It's part of my stained glass series. Item number 37 is a piece called Spiritual Realm, y'all. It's normally sells for $400 a day on Punchathon 44. You can get item number 37 for just $200. We are in the $200 section. And guess what, y'all? We have a record number of originals available on the show today. Item number 37 and sold, y'all. Let's keep it moving. And this piece will be coming your way. Item number 38 is an old favorite, man. This piece is called Little Rainbow of Faith. This piece came out in the 90s, y'all. You want to do a, a powerful piece that's kind of understated, that powerful black background with that little girl and the stained glass reflecting on her. Uh, uh, uh. That's right, y'all. Item number 38. Little Rainbow of Faith normally sells for $400 a day on Punchathon number 44. You can get that piece for just $200. It measures 24 by 30 inches. It is a 62 edition. If you like that piece, just put item number 38 and sold. And that piece will be coming your way. Item number 39, y'all, is a new piece. You know, I did some pieces uh, the last couple of years that are a combination of my photography work, uh, my graphic design work, and my painting. This is one of those pieces. Hasn't been shown really on Punchathon as of yet, but this is, I'll let you take a look at it. This piece is item number 39. It's entitled Guardian of the Night Flowers. Guardian of the Night Flowers. You know, I like to do things that are nature oriented. This is part of my Tree of Knowledge series. Item number 39 has got some funky, warm, and cool colors in it. Oof. Ah, can you imagine that on your wall? This piece is big, too. It's 24 by 32 inches. Imagine with that with a nice couple of mats on it. This piece is entitled Guardian of the Night Flowers, y'all. If you like that piece, just put item number 39 in the sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Part of my new work, I'm doing some digitally created pieces. This is one of them. And the next one, item number 40. It's part of the same series. This piece right here is entitled The Gatherer. That's right, y'all. A mixture of photography, graphics, graphic design, and painting, hand painting. Item number 40, if you like that piece, part of my Tree of Knowledge series. This piece normally will sell for $400 today. You can get it on Poncho Thumb number 44 for $200. And the one prior to it also sells for $200. We are in the G Clay section of the show, y'all. We are giving you an opportunity to see some of my higher end collectibles. Um, I, it's kind of a spring cleaning kind of vibe around here, y'all. Got a lot of nice things to show you. You know, I got a lot of work. Item number 40. If you like that piece, just put item number 40 in sold, and that piece will be put in your collection. All right, y'all. We're getting down to some. I got that special we did last week. We want to repeat it again, y'all. Item number 41. 
is an old favorite, y'all. This piece right here is called the Sun People. The Sun People normally sells for two hundred dollars. It measures fourteen by thirty-five inches. It's a sixty-two edition. Today on Poncho Thon number woo, forty-four. Look at this price. I gotta check my. I gotta check my right, y'all. You can get this piece today for one hundred dollars. It is a G clay piece. It comes signed a number. All of the pieces in this section come with all, uh, certificates of authenticity. The Sun People is part of my colorism series. It's also in my colorism catalog. If you like this piece, just put item number 41 in Seoul. And this piece, The Sun People, will be coming your way. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, you know, um, last week we did something that we've never done on the show before. Um, let me switch that around. We did do it on the show before, but never like this. We started last season offering flat rate framing. A lot of you out here have been buying work. You've been storing it up. You've been putting it in the sleeves. Some of y'all still got them in the tubes. Oh, y'all, please. And I'm speaking to you women. I know y'all going to say I'm sexist. I'm sorry. Because guys don't usually do this. Women do this. Y'all know who I'm talking about. You got all those rolls of, of, of your prints in tubes. And they in closets and under sofas and stuff. You know you can buy yourself a sleeve to flatten that out. It is not good to leave artwork in sleeves for long periods of time. Because you will force it into that shape. And then once you go to unroll it, it will create surface damage on your print. So those of you who have not gone to framing and are still tubing, please buy some sleeves. Next show, I'm going to announce where you can get those sleeves from. If you need them right away, hit me up in the DM, Art of Poncho. I will tell you where to get those sleeves. But just to get back. So last year, we offered a molding. I'm partnering with Davenport Framing here in Baltimore City. Davenport will pick a molding. He will pick a mat. And he will frame your stuff cheaper than you can go anywhere to get this stuff. And I don't really like to say the word cheaper because it's not the right word. Most of you guys are going to Michael's and you're getting framing that's supposed to be 50 to 75 or 70% off. But what you don't understand is that that's already hyped up prices and they're going to be selling you substandard materials. And if you go in there with the mentality to save money, they're going to trim it back even further. OK, so you'll still be getting billed three to seven hundred dollars for a frame that's supposed to be 50 to 70 percent off. All right. So we solved that problem for y'all. This is something we're going to offer you today. If you don't take advantage of this, just try to see how it works. Item number 42 and i'll explain to you what you are looking at item number 42 is um it's a molding it's a silver molding it's probably about two uh, one and a half inches thick and you also see this is suede matting so you got a choice of a dark suede green a black and a blue all right these frames he uh, my partner can do a whole frame job for you for $250, including shipping. You won't find that price anywhere. This is how it's going to work. You will pick item number 42. Uh, we'll put that on your invoice. I'll give you the address of where to ship your print. He will frame it and ship it to you. This is a special we did last year. We did fairly well with it. But this is what's different about this. Back in the 80s and 90s, folks was buying suede mat like it was, oh, Lord. It's like buying a suede jacket. Y'all just love it. This is a special that will not last long. Item number 42. Our color frame for this week is a silver pewter kind of a frame, okay? The next time we do this, it might be a different molding. But for this particular day, it is a silver molding. Item number 42 and sold. And you can get this piece. We call it the silver flat rate framing. You can choose blue, black, or green for your mat. That is also an eight ply mat for $250. That means that if you got a piece that's 24 by 36, and all the pieces I showed in this section of the show is in that, in that size. So if you want that, uh, Miss Wright, I can't sign you up. 
This is a participatory thing only. You will simply put item number 42 and sold. We will get your prints shipped to Mr. Davenport and he will ship it back to you. We have no restrictions on where you are in the country, okay? It is in the continental USA, okay? Item number 42 and sold and you can get this silver flat rate framing with a blue, black, or green suede mat for $250, measuring up to 24 by 36 on your personal art. I had a number 42 in Seoul, and y'all, I advise you, try it, see if you like it. This might be the answer you've been looking for. I had a number 42 in Seoul, and this flat rate frame in silver will be coming your way. Item number 43, oh, we're digging that back now. You know, this G-Clay here, this piece was a very, very popular piece for us. It was one of the first pieces of our Surrender series, our Perseverance series, excuse me. This piece is titled The Blackness. There is an offset version of this that is in um, a black background, but we have just reproduced a special edition of The Blackness. This piece is, came out probably in the, in the early 90s. This piece normally sells for $500. It is a special edition G. Clay. It measures... 24 by 30 probably 24 by 34 in size if you like this piece the blackness special edition g clay item number 43 just put item number 43 and sold and you can get this piece on poncho thon number 44 for just 250 dollars. that's right item number 43 and sold and you can get that piece for just 250 dollars normally a 500 dollar piece Man, this is a classic from the days. If you want that piece, just 43 and sold, and they'll be coming your way and added to your collection. Item number 44 is one of a rare piece of mine. This is a piece entitled Precious Moments. Precious Moments, the serigraph print. This is a serigraph print, a silk screen print. I cut that by hand with film, very similar to how the notorious KYB does her work. Um, but this piece was done back in the early 90s. It's something that's been sitting on my shelf and been kind of holding them as collectibles. We may only have five of these available for the show. Item number 44, y'all. If you like Precious Moments to Serograph, it measures 22 by 30 inches. It is a 62 edition if you want that piece and you want something very special and a high collectible. This would be a high collectible, way over G. Clay's. Item number 44, y'all. Precious Moments to Serograph. If you want that piece, just put item number 44 and sold, and that piece will be added to your collection. So, y'all, we're getting ready to go to the last few items of the show, the last five, six items of the show. Um, I'm just going to try to prep you so you can understand what's getting ready to happen. Um, but, but first, let's just take a small break. <laughs> Poncho Thon is coming to you f to celebrate and help commemorate our 36 years in the business, in the art business. All right, so this is where we are, y'all. In the show, we're going to have six originals coming up. These are the rules. Put your hands on your trigger. The first person to chime in on these selections, the piece belongs to you. This is These are one-of-a-kind original pieces created by yours truly. We can only go by timestamp on these selections. So if you chimed in and another person wanted it, um, we're going to have to go by timestamp. The other issue is we are allowed to do payment arrangements on these pieces. So when you get your invoice, we will break it down into two payments. You can leave a deposit and you have a balance. Okay. We don't do that that often. We're trying to do this now because we're planning to do a show devoted to originals. We want to see how you guys react. So get ready, y'all. One, two, three, four, five, six originals coming up next. One of a kind. If you want to build your collection, excellent place to start. Countdown for those six originals. <laughs> Item number 45, y'all, here we go, is a piece I call Fortress of the Mind 
Fortress of the Mind. These are new originals of mine that are a combination mixed media of acrylic on watercolor paper and some other textured. Uh, these pieces are all about texture. That's a real uh, feather in that piece. Fortress of the Mind is the title of this original. It normally sells for $950. It measures eight and a half by 11. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get Fortress of the Mind for just $450, y'all. This is a rare opportunity. If you want that piece, item number 45 and sold, and this piece will be coming your way. If you want this piece, please move fast. Um, remember, we are accepting payment arrangements on these two payments only, item number 45 and sold, and that piece can be yours. Regularly $950 today on Poncho Thon number 44. You can get this piece for $450. Item number 46, first person to chime in, is my copper repose pieces. What this is, is I have a thin piece of copper. I actually carve into it with a tool, and I actually paint it accents. Those green colors you see in there are accent colors. These are very, very rare originals. I do not show these often. These are copper repose pieces. This one right here happens to measure eight and a half by 11. This piece is entitled Favor. Favor. This piece right here normally would sell for $1,200. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you can get Favor for just $600, y'all. $600. Favor, if you like that piece, item number 46 and sold, and Favor will be added to your collection. Nobody's going to have these repose pieces. This is the first time we've ever shown them on Poncho Thon. Item number 47 is a piece called Balancing Axe. Balancing Axe. This piece is done on a uh, wood panel. It's uh, all kinds of paper and fabric and mixed media on acrylic. Um, this piece is, is um, you know, you, if you were looking for some collectible pieces, these pieces are a little different than all of the other pieces that I do. Item number 47. Balancing Axe, the original, normally would sell, it measures 16 by 11 inches. It would normally sell for $1,800. Today on Poncho Thon, number 44, you can get Balancing Axe for just $950. Move fast if you would like to add that piece to your collection. Item number 47 and sold, and this piece will be added to your collection. Item number 48 is another copper paper state piece. That's right, these pieces are all very, very special pieces. That first piece was done in copper this one is done in brass item number 48 if you like that piece this one is called bearing the load bearing the load is accented with brown acrylic on copper man whoo these pieces look so hot frame item number 48 if you want to add that piece to your collection they would normally cost twelve hundred dollars it measures eight and a half by eleven today on poncho thon number 44 you can get bearing the load for six hundred dollars if you like that piece, just put item number 48 and sold. And this piece, bearing the load, will be coming your way and add it to your collection. Item number 49 is a piece we call Black 2. Black 2. It measures 8.5 by 12 inches. This piece is an acrylic piece. Got some textured um, areas on it. It normally sells for $1,500. Use a saw. Part of my small original series. These pieces are high, high collectibles. Item number 49. If you like this piece, just put item number 49 and sold. And this piece, black, two, will be coming your way. Normally, $1,500. It measures 8.5 by 12. Today, on Punch-Out Thon number 44, you can get black, two, for $700. All of these are unframed prices, y'all. First come, first serve. The last item of the day, y'all. Item number 50 is a piece called Dexterity. Dexterity. It measures 8.5 by 11. The piece would generally sell for about $950. It is mixed media acrylic on paper. Today on Poncho Thon number 44, you get a chance to partake in this original and add to your collection for just $450, y'all. That is a wonderful collectible piece. Item number 50, Dexterity, the original. If you like that piece, again, put item number 40, I mean, item number 50 and sold. And this piece will be coming your way. Hey, y'all, I hope you guys like the show today. Try to give you a little bit of flavor of some different things, y'all. That's what we're trying to do. I got one more announcement for you. 
and uh, hopefully you guys will tune in again. If you want to see me this weekend, I will be on um, the BAM show. It's coming up Friday. Tune in to Black Artist Marketplace. You can turn to YouTube, Black Artist Marketplace. And you can see me do another presentation at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, there will be 15 other artists joining us on this event. So I hope you guys can join us. If you like what you saw here, tune in. They will blow your mind. You're talking about wearable arts, jewelry, a bunch of other things that will move you. Also, make sure you tune into our new website so you can see what's happening. We'll keep you up to date on what's going on. We also have a 3D tour on that site where you can actually see what's happening in my studio. And remember, y'all, the whole goal here is to... All right, y'all, that's going to be it for today. Hopefully, we'll see you guys next Wednesday, same time, same station, with another whole menu. You guys have a good evening. And guess what, y'all? Things are going to come together because we're working together. And hopefully, that's what you're trying to do. Until next time, peace out. Mm -hmm.